What's up, YouTube? I'm going to be talking about everything they should add in the next 2K24. That being said, first up, we got this 2K leaderboard. Now, look, they dropped this 2K leaderboard around 2K16, one of the first park games. Um, they had this little leaderboard who which showed the ranking of the players, of the top players. And it was real enjoyable. I'm not going to lie. If y'all know about this leaderboard, put it down in the comment section. But this is something that should return back in 2K. It would make the game great. Next, we got jump shot landings. Now, look, jump shot landing is not too big of a deal in this inside the game, but I did enjoy having these, and they just made the game really fun. You know, you put on the jump shot landing, and you just every time you green, you just pull down on the right trigger, and you do the, do a green animation. Those was really cool. Those was real enjoyable. They need to bring those back, man. So the next thing I want to see in 2K24 are, are these park badges. I'm not sure if y'all remember them. But there were certain badges that you could only get that were inside the park that made your player super overpowered. Like, um, I don't really remember, but as you see in the screenshot, they were green badges. They were green badges, and they just did. And there was a certain amount that you could get just by playing park. Maybe they could add, like... Like a wreck, uh, wreck badges. Like, you know, I don't know. That would be pretty tight to me. I think that they should add these back. They're a great addition to 2K. And I would, I would like to see these. Now, look, one of my favorite things about 2K were these 21 courts, whereas three players on the court instead of two. This was probably one of my favorite game modes, and I would go on 20 game streaks easily, just whooping, whooping folks daily, day, like day to day. On my grind you know these courts were really fun and if i were to see these in 2k24 it automatically would be a great game i'm not gonna lie to you they add these they add this back to 2k24 we have a great game simple as that so don't wait to drop these courts again man i want to play on them for real it would you know you'd be doing us all a great favor now next we got these custom t-shirts now i ain't gonna lie this is this was definitely one of my favorite parts about the game also whenever they dropped these you already knew the game was lit i ain't gonna lie to you used to have some crazy shirts in my collection it, it just made the game's customization just feel like the game already has a lot of custom customizable options already but the fact is that we get the option to create our own t-shirts, create anything we want with these. You know, the game went crazy with these. They need to add those, add this to 2K24. It's a must. I ain't gonna lie to you. They add these items, this game will go crazy. It'll be the best 2K we'll ever have. Now look, I ain't gonna lie to you. This rep system right here, this rep system went crazy. Now look, 2K... 2k did his thing with this level 40 you know gimmick i think it was pretty cool but this rep system with elite i feel like they should add a few more a few more you know elites a few more superstars maybe a few more all-star to you know keep the game a little bit different but as far as rep goes that rep system went crazy i'm not gonna lie they should bring it back like i said maybe add a few more uh a a few more elite status is like maybe make it go up to elite six or something elite seven but you know for the most part that 2k rest system had it going now look i know everybody remembers this spin the wheel this spin the wheel was comp it had up to 10 hours of double of double rep it had crazy prizes like unlimited boost um mascots a whole bunch of vc a million vc you know, it just went crazy. I feel like the rewards were worth hopping on every day just to just to be able to spin the wheel. And they have videos on how to cheat the wheel. It just the game was so much better with this. I feel like they should add this back. Okay, so now last but not least, we got high rollers. Now look, high rollers used to be in anti up. It was like a thing where they bumped up the VC prices and all the courts were super high like 5,000 VC, 7,500 VC, even up to 25K VC you could bet. And I really enjoyed those courts. Uh, if you're an anti up player, you probably enjoyed them too. It just makes the game a lot funner. If they want to make the game better, they need to add these things to the game. I'm telling you, the game will go crazy. 2K has a lot of great ideas. They just failed to implement all of them, you know? I don't know what their strategy is, but they need to take another route for it. If y'all enjoyed this video, make sure y'all go ahead and like and subscribe. I'll be coming at y'all with more content. And, you know, 
hopefully a 2k a 2k worker finds this video and and talks to his his group about you know these changes with that being said i hope you guys enjoyed this video like and subscribe and i'll see y'all later